Massively. Live from Toronto, we'll see you in just a moment. Welcome to HP at the Half, the NBA season just getting underway. Some good basketball for the away team. They let him hang around so far. Now it's anybody's ball game. Kobe scoring with ease against Toronto. At the break, 11 points, and the defense has been rock solid. The Raptors are still in it and going all out. They've been shooting themselves in the foot with all these turnovers. It's a sloppy brand of basketball. A rough first half for Jose Calderon. His shot has been AWOL lately. Still on the run in this one. Some fantastic numbers to enjoy here. It was the Bobcats with the win against... Welcome back, everybody. The start of the second half getting underway. Both teams battling hard through the first half. Here's LeBron looking for his first bucket of the game. Outside for Griffin. DeRozan with the rebound. DeRozan's got three rebounds now in this one. This game very well could come down to a few possessions, and if that's the case, rebounding could play large. Yeah, in a close game like this one, securing the ball is so vital. Griffin, good, and the assist goes to LeBron. LeBron's now got five assists tonight. Calderon again throws. And stolen by LeBron. Well, credit the defense, but you've got to be more careful with the ball. A splendid pass that time by Rose. Raptors trail by five. Now Calderon. Six points for him. He passes to Bargnani. Over Rose. No good from Bargnani. And here's Rose. Leading by five. Feeds to LeBron. The kick out to Rose. The tray. Count the bucket. Rose has got five now. Well, another uncontested three there. They've got to make some kind of an adjustment. I mean, they're giving up way too many open threes. Well, the last five hoops, three have come off wide open three-pointers, Clark. So it's one thing to give up one, but you start giving them three-pointers up in bunches, you're in big trouble. It's stolen by Rose. There's the three, and the shot is good. They got on this roll a while ago, and they just haven't looked back. And the Raptors call time here. And Coach could tell they were out of sync. Well, he's going to try to straighten it out. You know, when you look at cable and video games, the Internet now with smartphones as well, it's pretty amazing how much more accessible the game is to fans than, than it was back when I played in the days of um, hot pants. <laughs> Here's DeRozan, picked up by Kobe. Pass to Calderon. Covered by LeBron. LeBron against Calderon. Five to shoot. He kicks to Bargnani. That doesn't go either for Bargnani. Going back to the all-digital distribution of the game, Steve, the NBA deserves credit for really staying on the cutting edge. Yeah, for sure. And, you know, you can see games now uh, in 3D. You can see it on your phones. You can see games uh, on the Internet. It's just amazing uh, to think about the innovations uh, in technology that have taken place in the last decade. Oh! <laughs> now, they're playing so well offensively, and that's led to this double-digit lead. Guys, no resting on their laurels. They continue to get after it as if they might even be down. That's how they're playing with that kind of attitude. Calderon against Rose. Now here's Calderon. He has six. Shot to stop the drought. Johnson. Fires from 14. The shot's good on the assist by Calderon. Johnson's got his third basket of the night right there. On the wing, Kobe. 13 points in the game. It's stolen by Calderon. Lifts up. Johnson, good. Johnson's got four points now in the quarter. 
Probably time to bring an extra defender, change up the defense a little bit. Well, Steve, he's been so good. I think they got to take the ball out of his hands right now. This has been an offensive explosion, guys. They are on fire. How about a volcanic eruption, a flash fire? And defensively, I mean, your guess is as good as mine. They just hope that they cool off at some point. Gary Forbes checked in for Toronto. Bayless comes in for Jose Calderon. There's 138 left to play in the third. Here's Bayless. Straight up. Rose gets a hand on it. Guys, we have seen them with a lot of good ball movement. Well, you like the smooth operating they're showing you here. I mean, things are clicking, and more importantly, it makes them tough to defend. Yeah, there's no agenda. I mean, the ball's just moving to whoever is open, and as a result, they've kind of developed a clicking uh, kind of pace to their game. It's been fun to watch. It's stolen by Rose. And here's the break. Oh! 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 That's how it works. Your defense feeds into the offense. Yeah, you know, excellent work, I thought. Solid work on both ends in that particular sequence. Here is Bayless. And Rose picks him up defensively. A pass to Forbes. He's covered by Bosch. Here comes Derrick Rose. 15-point game for three, Durant. Rose kicks to Bosch. And it's Toronto with the rebound. A ways to get back into it, but they've got some time. He is to avoid mistakes and make each possession count. Yeah, and I think the tendency can be to, to really rush or, or push the game a little bit. I think they need to avoid that. Here's LeBron. Fades back. It's Gasol missing. Kind of a waste of a possession there. Absolutely empty trip. That's not the shot you're looking for in that situation. Here is Bayless, covered by LeBron. Bayless's shot is off. Oh, that's a frustrating one there. Easy look at the hoop. Durant for three, and he knocks it down. Woohoo, Kevin. They're firing on all cylinders. That shot kept. And as we end. On tap this Saturday. While we're still getting underway here in the fourth, let's go down to Doris Burke, who has our Sprite Spark of the Game report. Doris? Kevin, for the job this road team has done, they get our Sprite Spark Award. The changing point in this game was when they got hot in the third quarter and opened things up. They'll look to keep that level of play as we head into the final period. Terrific stuff, Doris. Thank you. That was quite a run they had, Clark. Yeah, I tell you what, Kevin, scoring bursts like that often tell the story, really. I mean... It's a no-brainer. And that's been the case today. I mean, that's what you'd have to point to, I think, is the defining moment in this ballgame. Raptors trail by 16. Here's DeRozan. And again, no good by Toronto. Here comes Kobe. Got a piece of it. It's stolen by Davis. And sometimes when you... And DeRozan throws it down hard. Now let's take a look at it once again with our Spike Slam Camp. Here is Nash. 13 feet out. And it's Durant missing. Here's Toronto now. Fader on the way. And it's DeRozan missing. And the fadeaway was about his only option there. Really good defensive position. It's stolen by DeRozan. And here they come. A finish. And it's Davis with the jam. Off to the races. Just really getting up and down the floor. Not much the defense could do there, guys, but let them go. And the slam by Blake Griffin. Boy, that is an alley-oop of the highest order <laughs> on the front and back end. Well, a play they've been working on, I'm sure. That's got to be the case because that was impeccable timing. Stolen by Durant. Fast break. Here we go. Releases from 15. LeBron dishes to Nash. He feeds it to Kobe. 
Takes the three. It's hauled in by the Raptors. Johnson's got three rebounds so far in the game. Calderon kicks to DeRozan. Picked up by Kobe. Fires the three. It's rebounded by Durant. And you can sense the frustration coming from him right now. He just can't find his game. Boy, he is missing a lot of chances, Steve. Too many. It's been a complete game for him, hasn't it? Yep, I agree with you there. I mean, he's been in the middle of everything going on. And some changes here for the Raptors. Amir Johnson's checked in for Gray. Marniani comes in for Ed Davis. And it's Barbosa in for DeMar DeRozan. Here's Calderon. Defended by Nash. Here's Barbosa. Rebound by Kobe. Kobe's got four rebounds in this game. Here's Griffin. Here's Thomas. No good with a triple. Raptors trail by 16. Calderon with it. Back to Barbosa. Shot tonight. And he recovers it. And here comes Nash. Kobe kicks to Thomas. And it's Johnson picking him up. The shot is off. And Toronto the other way. And here's Calderon. Pass to Bargnani. Covered by LeBron. Griffin on the double team. And again, no good by Toronto. Now Thomas. From deep, Toronto grabs the miss, and they're moving it up. Here's Johnson. He goes up. The shot's good on the assist by Calderon. And you see how easily he got around his defender there on the drive. Just too strong for him. Nash kicks to Kobe. Lets it go with a three. The shot by Nash, no good. And Toronto has possession. Here in the fourth, they've allowed just four points. Tipped. Here's Bargnani and blocked. And he's able to get it back. Stolen by Thomas. He's been doing a nice job taking care of the ball. Not many miscues from him in this one. That's his only turnover. No coverage that time. Well, they haven't gotten much production from him, but they remain in the lead. And the Raptors call time here. They trail by 17. 56 seconds left in the fourth quarter. The Raptors making a switch here. DeRozan's checked in. Marnani is screen on Rondo. Jumper off the screen. Backing him down is Johnson. Dishes to Johnson. It's stolen by Rondo. Kevin, he didn't turn the ball over once in the first half, but it's been a different story for him since the break. Nowitzki, the pass to Bosch. Rose. Nowitzki dishes to Rose. That drops, and it comes off an assist from Dirk Nowitzki. Well, they're just trying to run clock now. I mean, this thing is pretty much over. Yeah, there's nothing but the result to be determined. Um, so it's time to start thinking about the next game now. Gets the bucket. I like this composure there under pressure as he was being double teamed. Terrific pass. Here's Rhodes. 20 seconds left in the fourth quarter of this one. And guys, they can just sit on the ball here if they want to. Sure can, because they've earned the win. Here comes Jose Calderon. Gives him the lead pass. Johnson. And an emphatic dunk. Beautiful pass there. Five seconds left in the fourth quarter. From deep three-point range. Offline. And so the road team gets the W in this one. You know, Clark, every team has a bad night, and these guys might want to watch the tape of this game the next time they have a bad night to remind themselves. Every year I rejoice. 